my friends i'm going to discuss uh, and to display for you the equations of cable short circuit current capacity the permissible permissible the me, The permissible short circuit as presented in tables 11 to 13 are calculated in accordance with IEC 7241982 which are based on the following conditions. The permissible short circuit as presented in table 11 to 13 are calculated in accordance with IEC 7241982 which are based on the following conditions. Note that my friends all these equations was derived from International Electromechanical Commission and all companies in the world must follow and implement these equations when they design power cables. Short circuit starts from the maximum operating temperature. Maximum temperature during short circuit for XLBE equal to 250 Celsius degrees and for BVC equal to 160 Celsius degrees. Maximum short circuit current duration is 5 seconds. The short circuit current I shall be calculated from the formula where I equal to short circuit current in ampere T duration of short circuit in second K constant for the material of the conductor s area of the conductor millimeter square theta 1 final temperature in silesius degrees and theta 2 initial temperature in silesius degrees beta reciprocal of the temperature coefficient of the resistance alpha of the conductor You can do any calculation you need using this short circuit current capacity equation. Okay, my friends, let's see now. These data were derived from the IEC for short circuit cables. Short circuit current for copper conductors. XLBE insulated in kilo ampere and these degrees 90 at the nominal and the operating temperature but 250 this is the maximum temperature in a few in least one second at short circuit current okay if we choose uh, a cable of cross section area 120 okay we know that at 0.1 second the value is 54 kilo ampere and when you see at one second you will know that it be 17 if we goes up for if, if we goes up mo for more seconds okay if we if we goes up for if we go up for more seconds we know that these values decreases gradually until we reach 5 second and if we go up for a greater cross-section area of cables, we note that the value of short circuit current increases also. Uh, 
I want to tell you in other words at the beginning of the short circuit the value increase but after many seconds the value decrease if we note and uh, see about the aluminum conductors I think the value is differ from the copper conductors if we choose the same cross section area 120 millimeter square we will note that oh the value decrease 35 at point 0.1 and at 5 second 5 let's come back to the copper conductors at this cross section area it is 7 kilo ampere <coughs> mm -hmm. in other words at aluminium conductors the value of the short circuit currents is sorry in other words the value of the short circuit current for aluminium conductors are less than the value of the short circuit current are less than the value of the short circuit current for copper conductors and this this is real let's see about the short circuit current for copper screen we have three cross section areas for screens 16 25 35 yeah and if the cross section if the cross section area increase then the value of the short circuit current increase gradually and if the seconds are increases then we will reach to decrease in the value okay <coughs> 